Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on 7-point blood sugar profile monitoring, done in gestational diabetes mellitus. For introduction, GDM is diagnosed using MOGTT, when fasting blood sugar 5.1 or more, 2 hours postprandial sugar 7.8 or more. If fasting plasma glucose is less than 7 upon diagnosis, we can offer a trial of dietary changes and exercise. 7-point BSP in 1-2 to two weeks time and then start metformin or insulin if the blood glucose targets are not met after the two weeks. Whereas if upon diagnosis the fasting plasma glucose is more than 7, or 6 to 6.9 with complications. Consider immediate treatment with metformin or insulin. Then monitor 7-point BSP every 1 to 2 weeks and adjust medications accordingly. If indicated, provide each woman with 7-point BSP monitoring chart. Educate patients on how to record the BSP readings. Advise women to take meal regularly, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Check blood glucose using glucometer, before and two hours after each meal. If the patient is on insulin, take insulin after checking pre-meal blood glucose. To omit insulin if blood sugar less than 4. Take meal after half an hour of insulin injection, and check blood sugar two hours post-meal. Repeat the steps for lunch, dinner, and pre-bed. If a patient does not have her own glucometer, perform BSP at clinic. Preferably women with DM should have own glucometer, especially pre-existing DM, which will allow for staggered 7-point BSP at home. This is how we do staggered 7-point BSP throughout 3 days. Day 1, do pre and post breakfast. Day 2, do pre and post lunch. And day 3, do pre and post dinner, and pre-bed. This is an example of the recording of staggered 7-point BSP. For the target readings. For pre-prandial, target 4 to 5.3, for post-prandial, target 4 to 6.7, for pre-bed, target 4 to 5.6 mmol, l, that's all for this video. Thank you.